which we, report, we have been reporting in North Korea is largely believed to be behind the assassination of Kim Jong Nam. But the regime spent the day commemorating the 75th birthday of Kim Jong Il as if nothing happened. Its closest ally, China, is also keeping rather quiet about the incident with minimal media coverage. Our Kim Jong Soo zooms in on their indifference to the sudden death. It's been just three days since the death of Kim Jong Nam, which raised questions about North Korea's political stability. But the regime seems determined to use the 75th birthday of Kim Jong Il on Thursday as an opportunity to display its people's affection for the late leader and the legacy he represented. The day is considered one of North Korea's biggest holidays, along with Kim Il Sung's birthday on April 15th. After attending a general assembly commemorating his father's birthday on Wednesday, the regime's 33-year-old leader, Kim Jong-un, appeared at the Kumsusan Palace of the Sun Mausoleum at around midnight to pay tribute to Kim Il-sung and Kim Jong-il, whose remains are lying in state at the facility. Beginning Wednesday, the regime's state-owned media has released footage of special military parades in which military officials, including Hwang byung seo the director of the General Political Bureau of the Korean People's Army, promised to help realize Kim Jong-un's vision to the fullest. We pledge allegiance to our supreme leader, Kim Jong-un. Meanwhile, over in China, reports of Kim Jong-nam's death appear to have been pulled down from the main pages of Chinese websites, raising questions about whether authorities have blocked the news. China's government-run Xinamang and privately-run Wang Yimang sites have remained rather silent, aside from news about a briefing by China's foreign ministry held the day before. China's state-run CCTV reported on the incident in its morning newscast and only briefly reported on the foreign ministry's stance. Some analysts believe that China wants to minimize speculation that it was protecting the North Korean leader's half-brother, which could lead to a diplomatic conflict with the regime. Kim Jong-soo, Arirang News.